this is Monica. I guess I could call it a Robinson farm. It's not really a farm, but you know what I mean. An update on the hugo culture tomatoes. So this is the tomato tunnel where we call it the tomato tunnel where the tomato plants are so puny. It's August 13th today and there's only a couple plants making tomatoes even though everything was fertilized here properly. They're, they're just not doing good. So, um, there's the hugo culture over it with weeds. And I'm going to come up closer because you can't see. The tomatoes are doing absolutely amazing. So now they're about three weeks old. And they're doing a hundred times better than these that were here since uh, beginning of July or possibly end of June. Okay. So here, here is the hugo culture, hugo culture, or whatever you would pronounce it. And look at the size of these tomato plants, the abundance. So they're about three weeks old now. And just this is a tomato jungle and it's already producing big tomatoes. And they have been here, like I said, three weeks, not even that. I had no idea how good they will grow on the hugo culture, so I didn't write down the dates, and I should have. Next year, we're going to do a, a experiment, and my husband agreed that we will just put the tomatoes on the hugo culture, because this is just amazing. And you can smell the fresh, intense smell of the tomato plants, which is amazing. I haven't smelled tomatoes like this all year, despite watering and pampering the other tomatoes. And these are, are just completely untouched by us. We just let them grow and see what happens. And the hugo culture is so good for them. So I recommend it heartily. We are not going to have tomatoes in regular pots or ground or anything anymore it will be only on the hugo culture and if you know anything about hugo culture then you know that once you make it it will last for years so we don't really have to do anything with it we just plant the tomatoes next year and have a, a nice big crop unlike now where i had maybe five tomatoes from these little four plants that are probably looking over there and they're very jealous <laughs> well like if you liked it thanks